Hi, I'm Richard Cross, an approved trainer with the IRM since 2014. I've held jobs with Chief Risk Officer and Chief Security Officer titles in global blue chip companies, so I have both uh, practical experience in the day-to-day nitty-gritty of managing risks, as well as the higher level positioning and messaging about risk strategy and resourcing. What I love to do most is help people do better. And my approach to this is to try to make complex things simpler and to ensure that important but hidden details are properly brought to attention. Communicating clearly is at the heart of achieving this. And I, and I don't mean talking faster, louder or using bigger words. I think this means listening carefully to what's being said, considering wider context and comparison points and being aware of how our unconscious cognitive biases can skew our thoughts, seeking to draw out opinions, questions and concerns. Learning is an interactive process, a partnership between the trainer and the participant. For remote training, we use our multi-camera video system in our studio so we can be lively and engaged, which people seem to like. Studies reveal that people learn more when they're having fun and their curiosity is aroused. We do our best to promote this, which is why we avoid subjecting you to hours of looking up someone's nose from a webcam while they give out boring lectures. If that's how we approach our training, then what sort of subjects do we cover? The starting point is determining if people have unhelpful understandings about the nature of risk or the purpose of undertaking risk management. If those foundations are weak, that will then weaken the reliability of other risk-related subjects that follow. Risks are dynamic, not static. Threats and opportunities coexist. They don't add or subtract from each other. And I want to say that risk-taking is essential for life and growth, both for individuals and for organisations. Yet the risk profession seems to be undermined by the unrealistic Superman expectation that they can stop all the bad things from happening all the time. Risk management is about truly understanding the unique character of different risks and how they dynamically combine and interact, shaping the choices available to you. If the end goal of all your risk managing activities is just to put some static data in a spreadsheet or fill in a, a database field that won't get looked at for months, you might be missing something. Risks help us learn. Risk management helps us determine how much, how fast and how sustainable our learning is. We teach reliable methods for analysing risks from deterministic subjectivity towards probabilistic modelling. We teach how to understand and communicate the relationship between time and changing risk profiles. So important to gaining the trust and confidence of your stakeholders. And we help organise your risk managing efforts to achieve better challenge, cooperation and response. Whatever industry you are in, risks are perceived subjectively even if they're derived from objective sources. How we think about and discuss risks is inevitably affected by human and cultural factors. IRM trainers have worked on every continent in over 30 countries and that reflects my own experience too, having lived the last 20 plus years outside of my country of birth. We're always seeking to widen our perspectives, to get to know a fuller picture and I know firsthand that's something our clients really appreciate. I don't have to give anyone all the answers, but through the questions posed and the insights offered, they tell me that they feel empowered to take better risks. Maybe we can help with some of your risk thinking too, but don't expect Superman costumes. <laughs>